my name is Maddie and I'm a learning specialist here at the Cincinnati Museum Center and today we have a special friend with us. She lives here at, at the Cincinnati Museum Center in the Duke Energy Children's Museum. This is Kellogg, the corn snake. And if you are a recent visitor here or like to come here a lot, you've probably seen her out and about when we have um, animals up close out. She does live here. She is a corn snake. You can usually find them more um, in Kentucky. Um, and like their name suggests, they like to live in the corn stalks and the corn fields. The reason why is because there's a ton of mice and rats in those fields and they love to eat the corn. So the snakes do a great job at getting rid of all those mice and rats. And if you can see her coloring, she looks like Indian corn. So she's able to blend in really well. And what's really cool about her is if you see her belly here, you see all that coloring, all that crisscross patterning that also blends in really well with the Indian corn. But her scales on the bottom are really special. There are her arboreal scales, which means she can climb the stalks and climb trees. So the scales work kind of like how we work when we try to climb the trees. Our shoes give us traction, which helps us climb up those trees high. And so that's what her track her scales do on her stomach is she they give her the traction to just kind of keep climbing and keep moving around. Now snakes are really special because they don't have any arms or legs. So how they move around is they are made of all muscle and all bone. So they're able to contract their muscles so in that way they're able to have the smooth like movement. And then snakes are also really special because you see the tongue flicking in and out. That tongue flicking in and out lets them smell their environment and sense what's going on. So right now she's just smelling around because we are in the Children's Museum, so there are a lot of smells here. But she's also looking for some heat. Because snakes are cold-blooded animals, so they need heat to keep warm. So she's looking for heat, and I think she found some. Kellogg is really special though. She loves to hide, so she likes to go in our shirts, into our belt loops, really anywhere she can, so that way she can get warm. Yeah, hi. So this is Kellogg, and you're more than welcome to come visit her when you come to the Duke Energy Children's Museum, and we'll see you next week for our next Wonder Zone video.